Well, friends, you win some, you lose some. <laughs> uh, Friday, yesterday, was the new album from Tyler, Call Me If You Get Lost. And I did the whole video, I did, or the whole album. I did a video of the whole album. And as you can see right here, when I posted it, it got blocked. Um, I'm not surprised after I think about it. I, I was caught a little off guard. Um, you know, I can look at this, you can see, see detail, uh, learn more. So basically, uh, actually, no, let me go back. The only thing I can think of is that, you know, since the album just came out, they probably flagged YouTube and said, Hey, anybody who posts multiple songs in one video, they're basically doing the whole album, um, and uploading the album, which, you know, they clearly want to control that. And that's fair. I'm a huge proponent of supporting your artists. And so if, you know, if they're going to do the legwork to make sure nobody else is posting up on YouTube to try and make money off of their music, that's, uh, that's fair to me. Um, it's a bummer. <laughs> it's a bummer. An hour and 41 minutes worth of work. Um, the album itself is 52 minutes long, 52 minutes long. So that's about half and half of me listening and me talking. Um, I laughed because <clears throat> at the end, I said, you know, Tyler, good job. This is a great album. You'll never see this, but you know, good job. And I was very right. <laughs> You'll never see that video. <laughs> uh, so anyway, there's that. I, I did it. It exists. It's, it's, it's in a YouTube server somewhere in the dungeon, in the locked up digital cellar. Um, but enough of that. Let's talk about the album. So I do enjoy this album. I think it's pretty good. The first three tracks, I, I still can't remember how to pronounce that. Oh, another thing too, I was drinking. Like I got out my beer and I filled up my mug and it was it was a good time. You guys, you guys missed out. I still had fun, so it's not such a downer. But anyway, first three tracks open up very strong, very strong. Um, it kind of backs off again on track four. And then my favorite track is seven, Massa. I, I really like the tone. Um, how a, he kind of ramps up um, every now and then he you can tell when he's like getting a little bit more aggressive with his legs he kind of gets that growl I like it I like it when he does that um, run it up didn't really do a whole lot for me in the video that you'll never see I talk about how I, I just I kind of didn't really get it um, manifesto I really like but the music doesn't really do much for me I think the lyrical content is amazing uh, it's really, really good in terms of lyrics, but the music just didn't really click for me. And then Sweet, and I, I Thought You Wanted to Dance, it's a two-part song. It's almost 10 minutes long. That's a great track. It's a great track. Mama Talk made me laugh my ass off. Rise and Blessed and Juggernaut are all good. And then Wilshire really brings home this story of Tyler falling for a girl big time, and it didn't work out. Um... You know, I listened to the album twice again this morning, just back to back. And initially, when I listened to it the first time yesterday, I thought, Call Me If You Get Lost was more of a reference of him kind of getting swept up in just fame and, and traveling the world and going all these different places and life kind of being crazy. But now I, I kind of feel like it's a message to this girl. And I don't, if I'm, I, I mean, who knows if I'm right or not, I have no idea. But this theme of this girl kind of just breaking this guy's heart, Tyler's heart, it's, it's sprinkled throughout in the first half. And then when you hit Sweet, I Thought You Wanted to Dance, it really it becomes very clear what's going on. And then Wilshire really, really, really brings that home. Um, <clears throat> so I don't know. I think there's a couple layers to this album. Overall, I like it a lot. There's really only two tracks that kind of just... I don't want to say are not good because that's not what I mean. They, they just, it doesn't click for me in terms of, you know, what it is. Manifesto, the lyrics are awesome, but the, the music doesn't really do much. And then uh, Run It Up, I was just like, well, okay. Um, so, yeah, there isn't a whole lot to say. Great album. Very solid. Very solid. It opens up great. And then I love how the music's just changing up. Um, he's got all these quick little turns that he does with the, the sound and the music and everything. 
and it flows really well. Juggernaut, I think, is great because when you're in this midsection of the album, it's it's lighter. The tone is lighter, and then Juggernaut comes in with some really really heavy bass, which is good. It felt like I you know at that point we needed some bass to just kind of get back to hitting again. And then Safari is a great track for wrapping up the album as well. So. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll see. Maybe someday this this video will be released to the public. Um, I have a suspicion since the album just came out that yeah they're blocking it. I don't know if they'll ever unblock that. I don't know if if the record company or Tyler or whoever is in charge of this in terms of working with YouTube. I don't know if they can only have like a thirty day window or a sixty day window. I mean it's it's their it's their material. So if they own the copyright, they can do whatever they want with it. So it's probably going to be banned forever, blocked forever. <laughs> oh, well, it's how it goes. You know, this is how it goes sometimes. So anyway, hope may, maybe Tyler will see this video. <laughs> maybe. Good job, Tyler. It's a good album. I really like it. I think he did a great job. It's a, it's a good body of work again. Um, and I said this in the other video, but you've got some really good fans, my friend. You really do. Um, they've been great to me in just kind of guiding me through your music and explaining things to me and taking the time to help me understand. And it's, it's been a lot of fun learning your music. Um, I guess the next couple of videos will be, we'll jump back to Wolf and start working on that again. I've got, what's my list? I've got it written down somewhere. I've got like five or six, five songs, I think, left to check out on Wolf. Anyway, there's my story. There's my review, if you want to call it a review. I don't really like doing reviews. I just, you know, what I think of it. There you go. See you guys. One other thing to add to my sob story of this very long video. The hour and 41 minutes, I did it all uncut. It's one clip. There's no, there's no breaks. There's no edits. Nothing. It was a full trip through the album. Anyway, free Bob. Hashtag free Bob. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, that was loud. Sorry. Sorry, uh, headphones users. Sorry.